Lord, worship God with your hands. Worship God with your hands. Oh, clap your hands. Clap your hands. There's angelic activity. There are angels here tonight. Clap your hands. They are moved. By your praise, clap your hands. Clap your hands. The angel of mercy has some other angels tonight. There are angels all around us tonight. Hallelujah. Amen. Would you join hands with someone right now? So what I come when you come by. The Bible tells us that if any two of us shall touch, shall touch, or agree, whatever we ask, God will do it for us. God will do it for us. Squeeze the hand next to you. And tell them God will do it for us. Tonight. Tell them God will do it for us. Tonight. God will do it for us. Tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You may be seated. Ejoko. I am here on assignment. God has ordained that I would be in Nigeria tonight. There is a word from God for you. But I need you to cooperate with the Spirit tonight. Make up your mind tonight that you will receive from God. Say with me, I will receive from God as the man of God preaches tonight. Say it, I will receive tonight as the man of God preaches to me. Say it one more time. I will receive my healing, my deliverance, my salvation, my hope, my finances, my liberty tonight while he preaches. Amen. Amen. One of the things the church has talked about but not seen the fullness of Pardon? but has not seen the manifestation of is the power of God. But tonight, with these men and women of God, with these men and women of God, we have come to decree and agree that God is real. In your Bibles, in the book of Acts, 1 and 8, the Bible says, and you shall receive power after the Holy Ghost has come on you. And tonight, if you'll open your hearts and open your ears and receive 
the Holy Ghost will come on you will come on you tonight and power will live with you from this night on and you will not walk in defeat again you will walk in only victory and everywhere you set the soles of your feet, God will give it to you. Amen. 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 Power from God is not predicated on substance from man. In other words, men don't have to do it for you for God to do it to you. Men don't have to bless you. God can bless you by himself. All it takes is a word from God. And I have come tonight with a word from God for you. Receive your blessing in Jesus' name. In the Gospel of John, there, the Bible says, there was a man sent from heaven whose name was John. But he was not the light. But he came to bear witness of the light. And John says, the man that would come would baptize you, would baptize you, baptize you, with the Holy Ghost and fire. And tonight the fire of the Holy Ghost falls in this house. Amen. Amen. I have come to declare the power of God for you tonight. Mama, it will be all right. Father, you will be prosperous. Children, you will be educated. Your destiny, your purpose, and your future are here tonight in Jesus' name. Let's talk about power. Power literally means you have authority and ability. You have the authority to take everything Satan stole from you back. Open your mouth and tell everything in the earth and everything in the heavens and everything under the earth I want it all back now. Power means I want it all back. Is there anyone wants it all back? Do you want your health back? Do you want your peace back? Do you want your joy to come back? Get ready to receive it tonight. We must put ourselves in a posture to receive. We've learned how to give. We've learned to give. We must learn to receive. I need to help you tonight to become a producer. A producer. 
And not just the consumer. Our God has said, He gives us the ability to get well. You have the power to get well. You've got to receive it. Lift your hands and say, God, I receive the power to get well. I receive the power to be made well. I receive the power to walk in authority in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. And John says, and we beheld his glory. In other words, we must begin to see the glory of God. We, we have preached about the glory. We've talked about the revelations of the glory. But the Bible says, when the glory comes, it fills the temple. It fills the room. And all the people get caught up in the glory. And in the glory is the goodness of God. Pardon? Is the goodness of God. In the glory. Wave your hands. If you are in the glory. Stir up the glory. Over your life. Stir up the glory. That's in your belly. Stir up the glory. That's falling in this house. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I only have a short time. But it doesn't take God long. So in a few minutes, in a few minutes, God is about to pour on you the oil of gladness. Prophet oil, oil. Prophet Owa. Lati. Prophet Owa. Okay. Sorry, Wa. <laughs> Declare <Okay>. to you. Woli <laughs> Owa. <laughs> Laughter doeth the heart good. <laughs> he declared to you and I stand with him in agreement that the angels of mercy are with us but stationed in the middle of us is an angel called grace and grace and mercy shall follow you shall wave his hand over you shall brush you with his wings and God will bless you receive it now in Jesus now, the atmosphere is clean. There is no space for the devil. So get it out of your mind. You have the mind of Christ. And all things are possible. All things tonight are possible. Everything tonight is possible. Everything tonight is possible. 
everything tonight is possible. I came from America to tell you that.